The charges were introduced to clarify disputed dates in the initial ones due to a change in legislation that occurred in 2011. Dates of the initial charges were also amended because of this. Two final witnesses were then called to the stand, one of whom claimed Mr Laguerre was a joyful person who he had never seen act inappropriately. In closing statements, the Crown asked the jury to look past the change in dates and said they could be sure that oral sex and intercourse did take place, adding that the defendant had manipulated the complainant and had a tendency to do this to young girls. Defence lawyer Christopher Finch urged the jury to ask themselves if they could be sure beyond a reasonable doubt, arguing that historical abuse without any clear evidence is an easy allegation to make. He asked what a man can do if it isn't true. The trial is expected to conclude tomorrow.